Hi kids, are you ready for today's lesson? Today, we are going to learn Topic 3, Fractions and Decimals. The content standard is 3.1, Proper Fractions. The learning standard is 3.1.1, Identify and state the proper fractions with 1 as the numerator and denominator up to 10. I have cut this cake into three equal parts. That means there is only one cake, there are three of them and their mother wants to cut the cake into three equal parts. She cut the cake ready. Wow! Equal size. The cake will be like this. Okay, three parts are equal. I get one part. I get one part two. And then the mother said one out of three part is one over three. That means if you want to write the fraction for one part, we, we should state in the fraction. There are three equal parts. I want to take out only one part. That means the fraction will be one over three. One over three. The meaning of fraction is a fraction represents a part of a whole or any number of equal parts. That means fraction represents a part. That means here is we represent one from the three parts. Recognize fraction. Now we want to write the fraction for the cake took by the arena. Okay, this girl we name her as arena. Okay. There are two steps to write the fraction. First, count the number of parts taken by arena. It doesn't matter colored, shaded, taken or something else. And then, second step is count the whole parts. That means we want to find all the parts here. Okay. First, we should count the number of parts Arena take. She took only one part. That means the numerator will be 1 over, second step is count the whole parts. That means we should find all the parts, equal parts. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. That means your arena take the parts, but we should count that parts also. 6. The denominator will be 6. 1 is numerator. The line here is we call over. 6 is denominator. We can represent the fraction 1 over 6. We will write the fraction as 1 over 6. Here you can find the steps. First one is we should count the parts taken by arena. Second is world parts. 
Just follow the color. Purple, here is the numerator purple and the denominator is world part red color. So we should find from the up here. Read as 1 over 6. The fraction of the red colored part. That means we should state the fraction for the red color only. No need to find for the blue color. Okay, first, there are how many red in this love here? One. So the numerator will be one over. There are how many parts here? One, two. One over two. Now, you can represent the fraction in numerals and in words. We should write from the up here, 1 over 2. The second one. Okay, we should find the red color part. Okay, how many red color parts are here? 1. The numerator will be 1 over... All the parts here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. There are 5. We read the fraction as 1 over 5. In this activity, we are going to write the fraction for the questions. Say the fraction of one part. That means we should find for the one part only. Okay. There are how many parts we take? One over what is the total of the whole part? One, two, three, four. One over four. Okay, here. Okay, I took only one part. One over. We should find the total of the whole parts here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. The fraction will be one over eight. This one. We can find for the Y or for the green color. 1 over how many total parts? 2. Okay. Here we should find for the yellow color. 1 over 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. The new denominator is 6. We should read the fraction as 1 over 6. We can say the fraction 1 over 4, 1 over 8, 1 over 2, 1 over 6. Okay, second question. What are the fractions of the blue colored part? That means we should find for the blue colored only. Okay, how many blue parts are here? One, two. The numerator will be two over the total parts, including the blue. One, two. 3. The answer for the denominator is 3. 2 over 3. Okay, here. How many blue parts? 1, 2, 3. 3 over... All together, how many whole parts are here? It cuts equally into 1, 
2, 3, 4, 5. The fractions will be 3 over 5. Came okay, here. All the parts are equal. How many blue? 1, 2, 3, 4. 4 over okay. All together, how many parts are here? It cuts into 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 4 over 7. Okay. How many blue parts are here? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. The numerator will be 8 over denominator. All the equal parts are here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 8 over 10. To find the fraction, we should make sure all the parts are same. If we see here, the pizza first part is equal to the all parts. This one also same. This one also all the parts are equal. Say the fractions. Circle the picture of diagrams according to the fraction given. First, read the fraction 1 over 2. That means I take 1 part from the 2 parts given that cuts equally. First, which one will be the answer? A or B? Of course, A. Because the two parts are cut equally and I took one part. This one is wrong because this part is not equal with the parts left here. Okay, understand? 1 over 4. That means I take 1 from the 4 parts given. And all the parts are same. Okay. If we see here 1, 2, 3, 4. There is 4 parts. Is it all the parts are same? No. That means this is not a Answer for this 1 over 4. Okay, look at the second picture. Okay, there are 4 parts. Yes, all the parts are same and I took 1. Is it correct? Answer will be second one. First one is wrong. Okay, thank you. Now you can try to answer the questions in your activity book from page number 81 to 91. Thank you.